Let's simplify the fraction 20 20 fourths. Here's how we do that. So what we want to find is another fraction that's equal to 20 over 24. It's an equivalent fraction. It's just that we've simplified or reduced it down to its lowest terms. So we're really looking for a factor that goes into 20 and 24. And let's just write the factors for 20 and 24. So these are the factors for 20 and 24. We're looking for the greatest common factor. And it looks like the greatest common factor, that's going to be 4. So 4 goes into 20 and both 24. So let's move these over here. And then we'll divide 20 by 4. That'll give us 5. And we'll divide 24 by 4, which gives us 6. And we're done. We've simplified the fraction 20 24 down to 5 6. And we can't simplify or reduce this any further. So again, these are equivalent fractions. 20 over 24, if you divide 20 by 24, or 5 by 6, you're going to get the same number. They're equivalent fractions. It's just that we've simplified or reduced 20 24ths down to 5 6. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.